Hello everyone, this is Princess Twilight Sparkle from the Vanelli. Spoilers. <laughs> um, excuse me, that's my desk. I am in the middle of making a ton of ponies, some flourish up bodies for extra body work. But uh, this is Princess Twilight Sparkle. It was the first time that I have made, well, I made Princess Luna before, but it's the first time I made the Finale Twilight, and she's quite large. She's a very big girl, like, I have to kind of lean back to get the whole thing in frame because she's so lord. But, uh, I really had fun making her shoes weird thing to say, but her shoes were fun. They are also, like, you know, they come down and everything. I have the top stitched so that way they don't flop over too much for the person. Since the person wanted her to be, you know, nice and cuddly. So that's up there. We got her little necklace, her crown. Her crown was kind of hard to figure out how to put on because in the um, reference images for the show version of her, her crown is like weirdly sitting on top of her big flowing hair. So that was a little interesting to finagle, but it worked out in the end. Um, the way I did it, most people will sew the horn on top of the hair, but I really don't like to do that if I don't have to, so I have her horn. I did this piece of hair as two different pieces and then sewed it around her horn. Um, and then I have her, uh, this satin stitched to make it look really cool for the effect. There's her tail. Yeah, there's that. There's not really too much to say about a lot of these guys. Oh yeah, I did her wings the best. Like I did extra loopies here and everything. There's never too much to say about these guys other than I just had a really fun time making her. Um, she took me a while. Like I don't know what it was, but I kept getting like stumped with her with the hair and everything. But I think it came out pretty well in the end. So the commissioner is excited to receive her, and I'm going to go ahead and be shipping her off. Just a few. Thank you for watching.